One Odd Day, written by Doris Fisher and Danny Sneed, illustrated by Karen Lee. Wake up, the alarm clock rang next to my bed. It looked mighty odd as I tumbled from bed. The clock had just odd numbers. One, three, five, seven, followed by odd numbers, nine and eleven. I put on one sock and found one stinky shoe, pulled on my old jeans and a shirt that was new. What a surprise, I discovered three sleeves. One hung down my back as I hurried to leave. I gulped down my breakfast of burnt toast and eggs, while Princess, my dog, danced a jig on five legs. With three legs in front, she did not look the same. She still wagged her tail when I called her name. Here's your lunch, Mom reminded. There's no time to fuss. Grab seven bananas and go catch the bus. I bounced on polka dot bus number nine, thinking my class in school would look fine. I stared at the calendar, crawled up the wall. It only had odd days, no even at all. In math class, we learned from our teacher, Miss Dodd, that numbers called even are found between odd. Great news, I thought, going outside to play. Tomorrow will not be so odd like today. At home, I was eager for bedtime that night hoping the next day my world would be right. When I woke up, there were two stinky shoes. Princess had four legs. My odd day was through. Wait, now my room has six doors and eight beds. Today must be even. My mom has two heads.